We recently completed passenger side small overlap front crash tests on eight midsize SUVs to update our safety ratings for some of the most popular vehicles on the road today. The Institute started doing small overlap front crash tests on the passenger side because we had noticed that some automakers who had improved protection on the driver side were neglecting the passenger side. We wanted to put them on notice that we expect the same protection for both the driver and front seat passengers. The vehicles that earned overall ratings of good were the 2019 Kia Sorento, which was improved over its predecessor to provide better protection for front seat passengers, as well as 2018 models of the GMC Acadia and Volkswagen Atlas. The 2019 Kia Sorento is the only model among those we recently tested to earn an IHS Top Safety Pick Plus award. Not only is it good in the current test, it's good in all of our crash test evaluations and is available with a superior rated front crash prevention system and good headlights. The vehicles that earned an acceptable overall rating were the Toyota Highlander, Nissan Pathfinder, and Honda Pilot. The Highlander and Pathfinder certainly have structures that could be improved. And while the Pilot's got better structure, we observed that the dummy's head was able to strike the dashboard hard, thus denying it a good overall rating. The Ford Explorer is rated poor overall for small overlap front crash protection on the passenger side. The big problem is structural. This portion collapsed more than a foot toward the passenger, severely compromising the survival space. In crashes like this, we see a higher risk of injury. In our case, we saw forces measured on the dummy that are consistent with broken bones or dislocations of the right hip and lower leg. The Jeep Grand Cherokee is rated poor overall for small overlap front crash protection on the passenger side. The structure didn't hold up well, which probably contributed to the dummy's head pushing through the airbag and hitting the dashboard hard. In addition, the side curtain airbag didn't deploy, the door came open, indicating a risk of ejection or partial ejection for people in crashes like this. The current batch of testing clearly shows that there's variation in the level of protection afforded to right front passengers in small overlap front crashes. Some vehicles provide good protection, while others have deficiencies that need to be addressed.